Hi everyone and uh, welcome to the Cali Chronicles. I'm just sitting here going over some old footage from last year and I came across this one here and this is one of Cali's first tracks. Uh, went out to um, find a deer for this fella and he didn't make a, a great shot. Um, wasn't actually sure about the shot of where he hit it but uh, we had a little bit of blood. It wasn't great. Put Cali on the track and she followed it probably 100 yards or so and we jumped the deer. Um, so we decided to, to, to follow it just a little bit farther, another 30 yards or so, mark last blood, and then we got out of there. The next morning, went back there to last blood, and I put Callie on the track. Now, if this was a very fresh track like the evening prior, you would have seen Callie pulling pretty aggressively um, and tugging a little bit, sometimes even barking a little bit. Because this track is now 12 hours old, Callie's very calm. Uh, the scent is not as strong and you'll see her when she's working the track she's a little more methodical um, and so let's pick up here at last blood and uh, you'll kind of see what i see when i'm tracking a deer find it She's making pretty good short work of this right now. And now she's pausing. Sometimes she does that. I don't know what that is on the ground there. She stopped to sniff, but um, I let her sniff a little bit. That appeared to be a, an old deer bed. Um, I didn't see any blood in it. Um, I did mark it on my phone app. I have in my left hand. You can't see it on camera. Uh, but I did mark that spot in case I needed to come back to it. And you can see I'm bending over. Every time Callie pauses, give me a chance. I'm bending over looking for blood to confirm we're on the right trail. Looking around see up ahead to see if I see a deer while Callie works her way through this uh, mess of tall vegetation. And every time you're following the dog, you're, you're always questioning, are we on the right track? But you, you've got to learn to trust the dog. I was, it was hard for me to do that initially, but after, there we go. We've got some blood there, and I can see there's a little bit of, um, you can see that <laughs> brown matter was in there. So I knew it wasn't a, a great shot just looking at that. And she's picking up the track a little bit. I'm still looking ahead. I haven't seen a deer yet. I know we're on the right track now. Somewhere right about in here, I, I, I finally spot the deer up ahead. Here we go, I see it now. You probably see it up there too. Good job, girl. Good job. Good girl. So you can see there, Callie made pretty short work of that track. And uh, in all honesty, the, the hunter probably could have come in there the next morning and just kind of walked around and bumped into that deer, uh, even though the deer, the blood trail wasn't that great. Uh, but a dog really adds a layer of insurance uh, and confidence that you'll find the deer or increases your uh, chances of finding that deer, I should say. Uh, I was very happy with the way Callie did. This was one of her first tracks of the season, and she went on to have a phenomenal season. Uh, but I was just digging through the footage, and I wanted to show you guys that stuff. It's, I think it's interesting, and I hope you guys find it interesting as well. And hopefully we'll get a lot more content this summer and this fall. I'm going to do some training missions. I'm not going to bore you with a whole lot of that, but we'll put up some here and there just, just so you can see what um, we do when we train, or I do when I'm working with Callie. And, and maybe show you some old footage of her when I was training her as a pup. And then we'll get into the fall deer season. That's going to be the fun stuff. So um, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, go ahead and subscribe. And hit that little bell icon right there next to the subscribe button. That way you get notified every time a video is uploaded to the channel and to the Cali Chronicles.